Hello once again YouTube, Chris and I bring here bringing you some EVE today. A little bit different from what I usually post on my channel. Uh, I've never posted EVE content before. Um, and I decided that I would be doing this now uh, for my corporation uh, in EVE uh, because I think it would be really cool for them to have a completely noob journalist in their amongst, amongst their ranks. Or maybe uh, uh, some sort of like, you know, s cinemagraphic filmographer, if that's a fucking thing. So. Uh, basically this is a scheduled event that my corp had in EVE, uh, for any of people that are on my channel that don't know, uh, Space Game, EVE, there you go. I've mentioned it before, I assume a lot of you have at least heard of it, um, but here I am, flying in my Thrasher among this massive, glorious, uh, what appears to be a station puking out tons of ships. Well, it's fucking cool if you ask me. Look at that. That was really awesome looking. Um, we all jumped out, or we all undocked at the same time. So it just looked really awesome when I finally got out of the fucking loading screen and looked at it. Um, so yeah, we're off to do a structure bash, which is basically just fucking up someone else's shit. Like, it's like literally we go to someone's house and we, we shoot guns at it for like 10 minutes. And then we kind of leave, leave. We leave. That's all we do. We leave. Um, <laughs> we, we can't do anything because the structure will be put into reinforced mode and we have to wait like a day and a half or something. So, um, a little bit of background information for anyone that's new to my channel. I'll be posting this on the subreddit so you guys will, like, not know who I am if you don't already know my channel, which I don't think you will. Uh, YouTuber, been posting for two years, I have like 2,000 subs, and at least 200,000 views, uh, so that's pretty cool, uh, and yeah, I figured I'd be doing this for my corporation, uh, for EVE, like, kind of like a, not like a journalistic thing, but like the perspective of all of this cool content from a noob's, uh, you know, eyes, like a noob's perspective, because I am a legitimate noob when it comes to PvP, I've been in the corp for about a month, I've played for about two, so... I have a general idea of, you know, some of the basics of, like, all of EVE, but I don't know a lot about specifics. I, I, uh, the fucking ship I'm in is a Thrasher. That's probably all I can tell you about this fleet right now. Um, there's a fuck ton of catalysts. I don't know if there was any significance to that, but, um, here we are. We're just jumping around, getting to the destination. Um, so yeah, there's a whole bunch of that. Uh, fucking cool shit. I have disabled the chatter from the comms, so you won't be hearing that, and unfortunately that means I've also disabled the sound from the game, so you won't be hearing that either. You will be listening to some dubstep, some fucking dubstep that I have put up. Um, and I'm going to take you throughout the whole uh, day's events real quick also, because um, there's a structure bash and then there was f like a fleet fighting uh, later on, or just regular fighting, I don't know if there's a fucking term for it. We we fucking shot at someone's house and then the owners decided to shoot at us and that's totally acceptable. I, I would imagine a normal person would retaliate if you shot their house. Um, so, <laughs> it's not even their house, it's just a fucking thing that they owned that we shot at. I don't know what it does. <laughs> I'm telling you right now, I am a noob when it comes to this shit. Um, so I think this will be interesting, I think it might be entertaining for, you know, the corp as well as my uh, YouTube channel. Might get some people on my YouTube channel interested in playing EVE, although I highly doubt it because I don't really know uh, what you guys are into. I mean, I mostly post Minecraft and Star Maid and what else? I don't even know. Um, shit. Yeah, Minecraft. Lots of Minecraft. <laughs> uh, as per usual with every YouTube channel on fucking YouTube at this time. Um, so yeah, sped it up so that we don't have to deal with, you know, the 40 plus fucking jumps that it took to get there. It was not actually 40 jumps, that was an exaggeration. But look how long it took for that single jump, that's ridiculous. That was like a full 20 seconds through a fucking gate. Um, and you know, we're just a big blob uh, of ships, a whole bunch of catalysts, which, I don't know, it just looks really cool. Warping in and having all this, these ships in like a perfect sphere, just flying through space, like... I don't know. That's just interesting. <laughs> I think it looks pretty fucking cool. Um, I'm hoping to, you know, provide some really cool shots of, you know, the action. Show people what they missed if they weren't there. That's basically the whole idea behind this. Uh, if you're down for that, please tell me. 
uh, below because I really would like some feedback from my corp mates. I definitely know somebody will at least respond on the subreddit, but you know, if you don't want to go to the subreddit, tell me on my channel and comment down below. Um, tell me what you think of this idea because I really would like to do like this type of stuff when it comes to all the major battles and stuff that I get involved with. Um, in terms of what I accomplished so far with this corp, I joined, I learned to fly a few things, I joined a few fleets, I've gone on one roam so far, I've been involved uh, with a few other fleets that didn't really accomplish much, we're just dicking around I guess, and I got into the fight between us and RVB ganked, which was really fun. That was my first legitimate fleet battle, like first tie-dye, first everything. Uh, we took down a carrier, I think it was an Archon, I could be totally wrong, I don't know if that was an Archon. Um, <laughs> or if there's a carrier even called Archon, I'm, I'm pretty sure it is, I could be wrong, but whatever, there we go, I, I, I was involved with that, I didn't film it, but after I played that, I was like, yo, I gotta film this stuff. Lots of people were asking, you know, for video or screen caps, and I was just like, hell yeah, I'll, I'll totally do this, I think it'd be really interesting for me to, you know, uh, show not only the battle, but my perspective as a complete noob who has no fucking clue what they're doing, has no clue about, you know, the higher level of PvP in this game. I'm, I'm at the basics right now. So, we warped in, uh, we're about to find the structure, it's somewhere around, there it goes, it just appears. Um, it, fucking, it looks funny to me. It, I don't know what it looks like, but it reminds me of something strange. Um, it's an infrastructure hub, so I think it was owned by Against All Authorities. And the whole idea was that we were all going to shoot the structure at the once. Uh, we were going to shoot the structure at the same time and like just fucking alpha the shit out of it, at least in the beginning. Um, and I didn't have any of my guns loaded. I don't know why, but I didn't have any guns loaded and I was just like, yeah, I'll be, I'm ready to fucking do this. And there you go, you could see the lag from when we fucking shot all at once and I had nothing to shoot because my guns were unloaded. I was so mad because I thought that would have been really cool and I totally was not in it. I fucking swiped the key keys on the keyboard and nothing happened. So there I am just loading everything. Um, also, uh, because I'm a complete noob, if you have any tips for me, go ahead and tell me, like, stuff that I should know or do uh, down below. Um, that'd be great. Uh, so yeah, because like, I don't want to fucking be in another video where my guns are unloaded and I'm asked to shoot something um, <laughs> from the fucking start of the fucking fight. Um, so yeah, we're just taking this thing down to, what, 25% shields? Regular old structure bash. I don't know what it's called. I don't even know what this thing does. Uh, from what I understand, it allows players to build uh, upgrades for a system. Um, and that's it. That's the extent of my knowledge on this this subject. Uh, I read up about it, as you can see there. <laughs> I was like looking at the information. So um, somebody lit a bubble for a long ass time. I thought a bubble and a sino were the same thing. Apparently they're not. And now I don't know that, uh, or I do know that they are not the same thing. So that's good. That's good. It's knowledge is a good thing to have. <laughs> Fucking holy shit. Um, so yeah, just going ham on this thing. It looks pretty cool. There's a whole bunch of us just blasting away at this. Um, I went through, oh, I don't even know how much ammo I went through, um, at, at the end of this, a whole bunch of people were just out of ammo. <laughs> like, uh, you could see real, there real quick, I'm, like, a whole bunch of people were jumping on these canisters that somebody was dropping off, filled with ammo, and <laughs> even at the end of this, when we get involved with the actual fight with what I believe was against all authorities, um, nobody had ammo. Like, half of them had to warp off to station. Um, and you could see us all like floating around trying to get some ammo from these canisters. Um, I probably took more than I needed, and it's entirely possible that I wasted it because I my ship gets blown up later. Uh, we'll talk about that in a moment when it happens, but yeah. Um, <laughs> here we are, just going crazy on this structure, and you know, I'm sitting here... Apparently this was fast, this took like 15 minutes. And apparently this was fast, so that's surprising. Um, I would not want to be here for 45 minutes. Uh, destroying a structure. Here you can see I'm going through options trying to find out if there's a hotkey to fucking uh, remove all windows from my screen. I pressed it. I think there was a hotkey. I pressed it. It didn't do anything. So if you know how to like make it so that it's just a just space, no windows open, that'd be great. Uh, if you know the hotkey for that or how to do that, 
tell me, please, because like I want to show you some really cool shots, and I can't do that if I have all these windows open. Um, so at that point, I think we get the structure down to 25%, we're all just chilling, and then a fleet warps in, and we're told to get the fuck out of there. Um, so I'd, get, I'd jump the fuck out um, with, you know, the rest of the fleet. And then at this point, we kind of just dick around, and I guess it was just because we were in a really bad p position. Uh, I don't know. It was weird. Um, we f jumped in and jumped out, like, a dozen times at least. Um, and, you know, there was some, you know, some of us were able to hit them, some of us weren't. So I guess that's why we're doing that. I really don't know. I think we were just trying to get a better position. Um, and, yeah, that's that's all that is. Um, I like this shot, though. I thought this was pretty cool. I, I got this really cool shot of us with the sun. If this is it, I could be wrong. Um, is this it? I don't know. We all start, like, floating towards the sun. And uh, I turn the camera around, and it just looked really fucking cool with all these ships just flying towards the sun. That's awesome. And then, for some reason, I just decided to go south and not follow anyone at all. Um, I, I missed what he told us to align to. I don't think he was putting it into the um, the history, the fleet history, often. I don't know. So I just I just clicked towards the sun. <laughs> um, I did not align to anything. Anyway, um, so at this point, a few people are jumping off to go get ammo at the station uh, and all sorts of stuff, and, you know, uh, I'm just chilling, fucking not doing anything, not really contributing much uh, for the few times that we engage with the enemy. Um, I don't think I was close enough. Uh, I think everyone was way farther than 10 kilometers away from me. Uh, so I didn't think it was worth it for me to even try if we were going to jump out like two seconds later. And of course we continued doing that a few more times. Uh, you can see us jumping back in. No tie-dye, which is pretty cool. Um, playing, you know, full graphics. So uh, hopefully I can get you some really cool shots. We did totally fucking annihilate that one target. Uh, we are get got stuck in a bubble, we jump, or we try and um, burn our way out of the bubble, as you can see, we're making our way for the edge, and then the fleet commander warped us off again to helpfully get us out of this situation, um, and we do this a few more times, I do believe, um, right above the sun, very nice, um, so yeah, uh, oh, this is what we did for like 10 minutes, not the most exciting fight, I was hoping it would have been better than this. Uh, I thought we could have taken them, because it didn't look like there was a lot of people on field. Uh, this looked like there's a lot of enemies um, to me, and I don't know if it was because we were just in a bad spot, or they were, you know, sniping us from afar, or what, but I thought it was kind of annoying <laughs> that we had to jump in and out so many times, and I was just like, yo, let's just fucking burn for him and take him out. Like, we can handle it. Maybe I was wrong, because we totally got our asses handed to us later on, and I don't know if they warped in some extra help but um yeah we uh we kind of did not really uh manage it well um finally we uh this is the last jump i think we make uh we were told to fly towards the um the structure and we were hopefully going to be off the asteroid field that we just jumped to and if the enemy jumped to us they would have or warped to us uh, they would have been, like, kilometers off, and we would have put the same bullshit that we had done. At least that's what I think was happening. And then this happens, and I think this is just hilarious. Who's, the, who's our prober? Who's our prober? <laughs> Vivian, are you there? I'm uh, Jaren. Uh, can someone drag him to command? Vivian, go to a drag, drag me, please. That's at the very top of the concept. I don't know. I thought that was pretty funny, simply because, you know, for, like, five... Like, the whole time we were doing this, everyone was talking, and then it just stopped. Once that turned on, nobody said a fucking thing. Anyway, um, this is where we actually get involved with the fight, uh, and I'm gonna turn the ch fleet chatter, comm chatter on again, so you can hear some of the action. Um, of course, I'm still gonna talk over it. Um, two chimeras... Uh, warped in, so triage was um, on the fucking vulture that we were trying to take out. A few bubbles go up, so we're kind of screwed if we go um, chill around this vulture, which we all do. Um, for some reason, I could not approach the goddamn vulture for the life of me. Every time I clicked on it, it didn't do anything until finally it just worked. And then it just 
turn into a, like, a clusterfuck around this one dude's vulture. Look at all the ships around that. That is just ridiculous. I don't think that's, you know, an actual maneuver. I think that's called get on this dude's dick and then kill him. Because uh, that's what it looks like. And once the triage warped in, we kind of could not kill him at all. Like, we tried so hard. We were actually getting him down, and then it just went straight back up. Um, this guy didn't get uh, fucking broadcasted, so I did some retarded-ass targeting on this guy. Uh... And then um, somebody else uh, in a broadsword, I believe, was um, primaried. And it, I, at this point, I just lost all control of what I was doing. I, I did not know what to target. I was just completely clueless. As soon as I targeted one thing, they told me to target something else. So I, I kind of just gave up at this point. Um, I think we did take out the broadsword, but I don't think I even looked at that with my guns. Like, my guns were aiming in the opposite direction. I fucking... I have to reload. I'm just, I'm probably doing awful in the eyes of anyone else that is more experienced than me. That's totally fine. I'm, I'll, I'll accept that. I, at this point, I was just like, wow, this looks really cool. And then I fucking got killed. Like, instantly. I, 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 I was like, oh, instinctively reached to go uh, broadcast for armor or shields, and then I thought about it, and then I looked at how much I was already fucked, and then I, I just gave up. Tried to warp to station, realized I was in a bubble. So... As soon as I realize that, somebody tells me to, um, jump to station, um, or jump, uh, get out of the bubble to burn out the bubble. Sorry, can't fucking speak. Um, <laughs> bubble goes away, and I contemplated staying, but I figured I really shouldn't die out here. So I jumped out of there, and I escaped another bubble. And there you go, warp to the station. That was the end of the fight for me, but it was not the end of the day. Um, I'm on station here, as you can see, and the FC told all of us to undock, and I thought we were going to burn back to Sendaya as pods, just like, you know, a retreat, because for some reason we all had um, clones at this location. I undock, and then he starts calling primaries, and I realize that there's fucking war targets, or targets, on the goddamn undock, and I'm like, shit, I'm in a pod. And then I thought about it, and I didn't really care at that point. I was just like, I had fun. If I die, oh well. So I stuck around and, you know, got a little bit more footage for you. I'm in a pod. I didn't bother to do anything at the station or get anything. Uh, I don't even know if I checked to see if the rookie ship spawned for me. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm just looking at the, the little bit of action that's happening outside of the station. Um, and that's it. Uh... Unfortunately, I look at somebody and then like I am I get fucking destroyed um, once I look at this person um, <laughs> People are telling me to like primary stuff, and I'm just like I can't primary them I'll just look at them. So that's what I did. I looked at my pod and Then I looked at this dude, and I was like wow look at this guy. He's in a fucking what is it a vulture? That's that's what I yeah, it looks like that and then I blew up then I died <laughs> And it didn't even give me a chance to realize that I died. I just fucking got exploded. Like, that was it. I, fucking there I go. I'm back in E-Tech Y and I was just like, well, I guess I'm done. Um, it seems like they had a little bit more fun. I upgrade my clone immediately and that's it. That's pers the perspective of a player, a complete noob, on the last and latest Burning Nation, uh, you know, mission. Whatever. <laughs> so... Thanks for watching. Please leave some feedback uh, on the subreddit or in the comments. Tell me if you would like to see more of this. Tell me what I can do to improve this, if I should speed up more of it or not. Um, I'm definitely going to try and, you know, get some actual sound effects from the game. Probably not the fleet cops, but yeah. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. I, basically, this is a scheduled event that my corp had in EVE. Uh, for any of people that are on my channel that don't know, uh, Space Game, Eve, there you go. I've mentioned it before, I assume a lot of you have at least heard of it. Um, but here I am, flying in my Thrasher among this massive, glorious, uh, what appears to be a station puking out tons of ships. Well, it's fucking cool, if you ask me. Look at that. That was really awesome looking. Um, we all jumped out, or we all undocked at the same time. So it just looked really awesome when I finally got out of the fucking loop. All of EVE, but I don't know a lot about specifics. I... I... Uh, 
the fucking ship I'm in is a Thrasher. That's probably all I can tell you about this fleet right now. Um, there's a fuck ton of catalysts. I don't know if there was any significance to that, but um, here we are. We're just jumping around, getting to the destination. Um, so yeah, there's a whole bunch of that. Uh, fucking cool shit. I have disabled the chatter from the comms, so you won't be hearing that, and unfortunately that means I've also disabled the sound from the game, so you won't be hearing that either. You will be listening to some dubstep. Some fucking dubstep that I have put up. Hello once again YouTube, Chris and I bring here bringing you some EVE today. A little bit different from what I usually post on my channel. Uh, I've never posted EVE content before. Um, and I decided that I would be doing this now uh, for my corporation uh, in EVE uh, because I think it would be really cool for them to have a completely noob journalist in their amongst, amongst their ranks. Or maybe uh, uh, some sort of like, you know, s cinemagraphic filmographer, if that's a fucking thing. So. Uh, I've been posting for two years, I have like 2,000 subs and at least 200,000 views, uh, so that's pretty cool, uh, and yeah, I figured I'd be doing this for my corporation, uh, for EVE, like, kind of like a, not like a journalistic thing, but like the perspective of all of this cool content from a noob's, uh, you know, eyes, like a noob's perspective. Because I am a legitimate noob when it comes to PvP. I've been in the corp for about a month. I've played for about two. So, I have a general idea of, you know, some of the basics of, like, opening screen and looked at it. Um, so yeah, we're off to do a structure bass, which is basically just fucking up someone else's shit. Like, it's like, literally, we go to someone's house and we, we shoot guns at it for, like, ten minutes. And then we kind of leave, leave. We leave. That's all we do. We leave. Um, <laughs> we, we can't do anything because the structure will be put into reinforced mode and we have to wait like a day and a half or something. So, um, a little bit of background information for anyone that's new to my channel. I'll be posting this on the subreddit so you guys will, like, not know who I am if you don't already know my channel, which I don't think you will. Uh, YouTuber, 